What's up guys? Welcome to the Macintosh Review. Tons of requests for this video, so here I am finally doing the video for you guys. You guys all want to know how to get Phantom for Snapchat. Basically what this application allows you to do is save snaps, change Snapchat filters, fake geotags, anything you can think of in Snapchat. I'm going to show you guys how to install it today. Now like I said, a lot of you guys have requested this. This method is going to be using Cydia, so you do need to be jailbroken. The good news is that if you are on iOS 9.3.3, you can actually jailbreak the link will be down there in the description for my guide on how to jailbreak your device so first off make sure you are jailbroken and get yourself Cydia installed on your device once you are jailbroken and you have Cydia go ahead and download snapchat as you guys can see I have snapchat installed here I have just set up a fresh account to do this for you guys and to show you exactly how it works on my iPhone 5s so it's pretty simple to install phantom all you have to do is open up Cydia here guys then you're gonna go ahead and go into the search tab and type in phantom for Snapchat. Once you do that, it should pop up for the installation here. As you guys can see, it is actually hosted on the Big Boss repo, which actually should be included in the Sources tab when you actually jailbreak your device. As you can see, I have the Big Boss repo installed right there, so it did pop up for me. And all you're going to go ahead and do is click Install, then confirm it, and it will start to download on your device. Your device will have a lot of code on it, just like this, and then it will actually respring your device. So I'm going to come back when my device is actually resprung. As you guys can see I got an option to restart my springboard I'm gonna go ahead and click that my device is gonna respring and I'm gonna be back on my lock screen then all you have to do is unlock your device guys and open up snapchat and you should have phantom for snapchat installed as you guys can see I have a little pop-up that says thanks for installing phantom this tweak is powered by advertisements show your support by purchasing a license within settings so that's how you install phantom guys so as you guys can see a lot of new features right here on the main screen of snapchat right after installing phantom first off you can actually time your snaps all you have to do is enter how many seconds you want it to time for and it will snap the photo after that many seconds. You can also upload directly from your photo or camera roll. When you scroll over to the right to actually view stories in stealth mode, just click the little swiper up there and it says stealth mode activated. You can now view your friend's stories without sending a viewed stamp. Pretty cool if you want to keep your friends from knowing that you're actually looking at their Snapchats and you can turn it off right there to continue letting them know that you are looking at them. There's also a lot more that they actually list in the description of Cydia here of the application. As you can see, it says require Snapchat. You can keep snaps in your feed and mark them when you see fit. So that basically means when you're in Snapchat and you're viewing all of these snaps, you can go ahead and mark them as red whenever you see fit if you receive them from friends before they're automatically marked as red. You can also automatically save these sent snaps to your camera roll. You can also disable Phantom in the settings application. There is an option to click open in Snapchat when you're outside of the application. Pretty cool. You can save all of the received media on Snapchat to your camera roll, to a photo album, or to a password protected folder in iTunes. You can add caption effects and there are a lot of notification features. There are a bunch of screenshots here in Cydia as you guys can see. Saving it to the photos, saving it to Phantom, you can mark them as red just like that. There's an option to always keep the snaps and disable hold to view. You can also password protect your snaps. If you go into the settings of Snapchat, you should be able to see the Phantom options. You can save your snaps automatically, the ones you receive and you send anywhere you specify. You can also auto save anything you get. It will show you exactly the saved media you have. You can password protect all that media as well. You can customize the feed options. Obviously you can do all these different cool things inside of Snapchat. The camera, you can also do exactly what you want there with in terms of sound effects and all that good stuff. You can also increase the limit of your snaps in terms of time. Same deal with the chats within Snapchat and overall just a lot of really, really cool features features here inside of the settings portion of Phantom. So overall guys, that is Snapchat++ or Phantom for Snapchat. You guys really wanted me to do a tutorial on this, so hopefully you enjoyed this video. And like I said, you do need to be jailbroken, so the link down there will help you out to do that before you install Phantom for Snapchat. I will probably be doing a guide on this in the near future without jailbreaking, so stick around for that. Be sure to subscribe and rate thumbs up so you don't miss it. I've also got links for you guys to get paid iOS and Android apps down there in the description. And be sure to follow me on Twitter, Facebook, Google+, and my website page down there in the description for more jailbreak videos. Anyway, hopefully you guys enjoyed this video, and as always, guys, stay awesome, and I will catch you next time. Peace.